Also new at six, the city of Atlanta is averaging a murder every other day in the first 12 days of 2017. Channel 2 investigative reporter Mark Winnie is live at Atlanta Police Headquarters. And Mark, a deputy chief says APD is concerned, but they have several new strategies now in place. That is correct. Deputy Chief Daryl Tollison told me as the man over criminal investigations, he knows APD was basically attacking the problem before it even developed, and he took us inside the new plans. As of Thursday afternoon, how many homicides so far in the city of Atlanta? So far this year, we've had six homicides. How alarmed are you? Well, we're concerned about the trend. Uh, anytime you have homicides, we get concerned. But last year, this time last year, we had two. At the end of January, we had uh, eight. More murder. Atlanta Police Deputy Chief Daryl Tollison says four additional detective slots have just been added to APD homicide, and the officers filling them were among those in a briefing we shot. A plan in place, he says, even before 2017's relatively deadly start. Last year, how many homicides? 111. And that was the first time? Since 2008, that we've been over 100. As he spoke, the major and lieutenant in his chain of command, he says, are responsible for finding killers were with him. He says authorities took charges in 71% of Atlanta homicides last year, but preventing murder is another matter. You know, our concerns, Mark, is always about the shooting, because the shooting is what's going to drive your homicides. He noted killers don't use guns in every slang. Of our six homicides this year, four of them were shootings. We're taking the shooting so seriously this year that we've created an excellent new unit to handle guns. Crime. Says APD is focused on reducing shootings through patrol strategies, but also other moves, including a new combined gun crime and gang unit online this week. Deploying some additional resources from the field operations division. Is Atlanta a less safe place? No, I don't think so. Since the Mayor Reed took over, we're still 27% down in crime. We were down 3% in 2016. Like Just seeing that. Spiking nationwide. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, it's, it's throughout, really throughout the country that we're beginning to see. Uh, an increase in violent crime throughout, throughout the entire country. It's not just an Atlanta concern. Now, Tullison says, bottom line, be clear, the city is not out of control. He says APD believes some homicide shooters may be repeat offenders who shot people before but who were not arrested or who got out if they were. And a new ballistic strategy uh, with the city crime lab is also underway. Major Adam Lee indicated the other two homicides including, included a stabbing where the suspect was 77, the victim 63. Reporting live outside Atlanta Police Headquarters, Mark Winnie, Channel 2 Action News.